Great to see you, Nick. We're back at Synaptics booth and we're showcasing our Makina solution, which is our Astra technology. Our Astra technology here is unique at the show because so many people are talking about having AI. We're showing, this is AI for real. So what we have here is we have a number of our modules. These are highlighting the capabilities. These modules are flexible in their design. So this is actually a board. We can replace this board or change this board. So this is completely flexible. This can have our 1620 chip, our 1640 chip, or our 1680 chip. So we've got a whole range of, of NPU solutions on our SL series. Here, what we've done is we've taken our SL1620 and our wireless package, our 43711, and integrated into a SIP solution. So what you're seeing on the top there is a, is a SIP package. Normally, the wireless on our Machina board would go onto an M.2 card on the back of Machina itself. So that's giving flexibility for the design, but it can also go into a SIP package. Now, let's show what we're actually showcasing here. So we've got our Astra solution driving eight videos. You see these eight videos here and a camera feed live all through our SL1680. Over here on the left-hand side, we're running multiple AI models. So you'll see again, we've got our Machina board, we're running our SL1680 here, and we're running several concurrent AI models, which is giving us facial detection. So you can see the two of us are being recognized here. We're doing object detection, so you can see this is highlighting as a keyboard and as a mouse. We're doing pose estimation, so you'll see this is us here. It picks up my arm when I move it up and down. It's picking up people in the background. If we stand back a little bit, you'll see how it, it picks up our body, and you can see all the joints are articulated as we move. This is all concurrently being run on our Astra platform. Now, in terms of bringing this to market, we just launched this a couple of months ago in April. But now this week here in Computex, we're also doing training to the market. So we're taking this, we're training the marketplace here in terms of the capabilities. We're getting people live onto our Makina boards. These are gonna be available very shortly to order into the market. And it really accelerates design times for AI solutions in that edge embedded space. So what happens when you train uh, your, your customers or your, your trainers and everything? Great question. So, I mean, the world really opens up at that point. So edge AI, opens so many capabilities for us at Synaptics. So think about this, right? Your Edge AI solution, you're processing everything actually at the edge. You're not necessarily going up to the cloud. So the capabilities that we've got here is to enable products like security cameras, next generation appliance products, you know, your washing machines at home and things like this. It can be almost anything that you can imagine now can have all of that processing capability at the edge. And the beauty about our Astra platform is we have the capabilities to range from MPU all the way down to MCU. So think about a range of between two tops right the way up to eight tops of performance, which gives you an awful lot of flexibility into your design cycles. That's what we're unleashing to people this week. And so that means it's real, it's out there, it's and, uh, and then the next step is to see how big it's going to be, right? Absolutely, absolutely. This is just the very beginning of the journey for AI. We're excited to have this position. We're super excited to be showcasing AI for real in the wild, but moreover, to enable the marketplace to be able to build some great new products. So what has been the response from uh, your customers or from, the, from the industry? Since our launch since at Embedded World? Embedded World. Ecstatic. I mean, we've got so much feedback, so much interest. That's why we're, we're very rapidly running these training courses. We ran our first training course at Embedded World, and we actually had people for the first time take the board, load a model, an industry standard facial recognition model, from TensorFlow down onto the board, optimize it using our software, and, and bear in mind that you know the Machina platform, it's, it's a full platform. So whilst this is dealing with all of the modalities, we've also enabled the capabilities for our toolkit. So we've built a toolkit which is available. Everything for Machina and for the Astra series is also open source. So it's providing complete flexibility for people. But using the toolkit, we showcased at Embedded World, being able to download a standard facial recognition model, squirt it down into the chip itself, then optimize that with our toolkit, and that optimization delivered 100x latency performance benefits. That's huge. So, you know, the reality of, of I think, AI is 
everybody is at a different stage on their journey. I think what we're hearing from so many people is that everybody wants to design AI into their new packages. Some people are sure and know exactly what they want, some people are not sure. So we need to enable people at all stages of the journey. Right from the beginning where you might be taking a model from a model zoo, right the way through to people who've got their own data and building their own models. And so that's really what the, the Astra platform has been designed to be able to do. And the development kits, availability, shipping? So we announced early access back in April. We're now only in June. We're doing the training this week. And these will be available to order very, very soon.